Hello internet world. Welcome to a new video on the Geek and Noise channel. Now if you watch my videos regularly you'll know that I absolutely love smart home products, home automation, lights, anything like that really do interest me. TP-Link very kindly sent me in this product free of charge for this video and it's their TP-Link CASA smart Wi-Fi power strip. Now I've used their uh, sort of plug sockets before, the smart sort of uh, single plug sockets. This is a power strip that offers up surge protection, USB sockets and three uh, inputs as well, three plug sockets. But the real special thing on this, the thing that's really impressed me, is that each of these is individually controllable via their app. So this is what the product box looks like. The product works with um, smart home assistants as well the sort of Amazon Alexa one and also the Google Smart Home Assistant. Uh, this is what it looks like. It's very nicely made, really good quality product. Satin finish to it as well, rather than being gloss. Feels very robust. It has got some sort of keyhole uh, mounts on the back. So you could mount it to a skirting board or a wall if you wanted to, or the underside of your desk, for example. Little rubberized strips as well to stop it from sliding around. Uh, fairly long cable. Uh, we're in the UK, so this is terminated with a 3-pin UK plug. The nice thing about this is we've got some LEDs on here as well for feedback, one of them indicating surge protection. And then each of the three plug sockets is individually switched. And there is a little push button, so you can actually turn these on and off via the unit itself. Or, as I mentioned before, you can control it with the app. Now, I've got the app running here. I've got it running on another plug, just to give you a demonstration of how you control it. Uh, something else to mention, of course, is we've got two USB sockets as well. So, really nicely made. Uh, let's just take a, a very quick look at what the app looks like. So, this is actually controlling another plug at the moment. It's not controlling this, this one. Uh, but, this is what the app looks like. And you can set schedules. So, for example, you could add a schedule for the plug socket to turn on and off at a certain time. Also, a timer. There's an away mode. And also, on some, uh, you can monitor the energy as well. Uh, on this particular product, uh, I don't believe that it monitors the energy. But certainly, on uh, some of their plug sockets, you can monitor the energy as well. But it's the scheduling function and being able to turn on and off the plug sockets individually that really does uh, work extremely well. And if I just turn the one off that I'm controlling at the moment, you'll see the light change in the video because this is controlling one of my studio lights. And in fact, if I switch back uh, to this camera, you can see that as I push the on off button, it changes the light and turns the light on and off. It's just really convenient. And the fact that you can schedule this as well, uh, what I've been using uh, this particular trailing socket or, or extension uh, extension cord for is for uh, nighttime use. So I charge various devices at nighttime, uh, plug them in here, and then I have them turn on at 10 p.m. and then stop charging at 2 a.m. as an example. Uh, and that means that you're sort of saving energy. To me, it feels a little bit safer as well. I'm in control of my devices. It gives them four hours to charge, which is plenty, and then turns off. Very, very good indeed. And also, if I forget to turn something off, of course, I can turn these on and off, even if I'm not in my house or my office, where I've, where I've, wherever I've got this located, I can turn it off from a remote location. So if I was away on business and I'd forgotten to charge something or turn on a security camera or turn off uh, a kitchen appliance, for example, I can do that remotely, all with this power strip. Three individual plug sockets. I just, if you'd have had to turn the whole thing off as one, it wouldn't have been as useful. But having them individually controllable is exceptionally useful. So, very, very good. I can certainly highly recommend it. I've left a link down below to where you can actually purchase this product for yourself. Also, a link to the TP Link website. So, please do check out those links in the video description. Let's take a look inside the live chat. This is live, of course. So, you can use the live chat or the super chat if you want to support the channel. We've got Craig, Sandor, the iPad Kids, Seawinds, uh, and Golden Solution all in the live chat. Thanks for tuning in live. 
Uh, for those of you who stay tuned to the end of the video, I always give you a little sneak peek uh, towards the end of the video. You see just here, oh, this is, let me just turn the screen on. Oh, what's that? A new product. I'm doing a video on that next, straight after this video. It is the new iPad Pro Magic Keyboard. So that's coming up right after this video. So do tune in for that as well. Um, I'm hoping my battery lasts on my overhead cam so I can give you some really good shots of it. But anyway, that's it for this product. The TP-Link CASA Smart Wi-Fi Power Strip. Highly recommended. It gets my thumbs up. And I hope that you hit the thumbs up or like button on this video as well. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you in another video very, very soon.